It is very important that we maintain the website that we create, and while doing so, we don't want to lose any data. Especially if you're hosting a website, you have a lot of user roles, users, and even dynamic roles that you don't want to lose. What do you do in this kind of situation? We create a backup. Now, with Whole Select, you can easily import and export your data without any hassle. When you go to the dynamic role section or the user role section, and even the user section of Whole Select, there are import and export button available. You can easily export your data with just one flick. You have a backup for your dynamic roles. Similarly, we can download our data from our user roles as well as a backup for your users. That's it. Even the process of importing the data is just that simple. You just have to click on the import button, select the file that contains your data and click on continue. You can also select the data that you want to include or exclude. We will have a more in-depth look at it later in the video. Then click run the importer. And that's it. If there are any errors, you can click on the error log. Refresh the page. And all your previous dynamic rules are imported instantly. And if you want, you can also make changes within your backup file. Like if you change the name of the column. And save. When you import the file, you will see the category list has been changed from category in list. You can decide if you want to import it and you can set the field that it is supposed to go against category in list. Then click on run importer. That's it. You can not only import the files within this website, you can import the files within all the website that has all selects. So if you're creating a new website, and you want to import your previous customer data, your previous dynamic rules, and also your previous user rules, you can do so using all selects. So that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. If you have any more questions or suggestions, feel free to drop them in the comment section below.